explosion at PSENG substation rocked a neighborhood in Bergen County, New Jersey today and pumped thick black smoke into the sky. Nearly 2,000 customers temporarily lost power. TV 1055's Tracy Carrasco has the story new at 9. She's live in Waldwick. Tracy? Alice, right behind me is that PSENG substation. Now, this intense fire burned for several hours, and right now there are just a few crews left out here to make sure everything is under control. I was in the house, and um, all of a sudden a loud bang, and the whole house just shook. Waldwick, New Jersey residents shaken this morning after an equipment failure at the Hopper Avenue PSENG substation sparked flames and sent thick black smoke shooting skyward. The first few moments caught on cell phone video. Residents say it sounded like some kind of blast. All of a sudden you hear like these shots, you know, and I was scared. Started running down the block and everybody came out of the house because everybody felt the same thing. It was really intense. Residents in the immediate area were evacuated from their homes right away and not allowed back in until it was safe. Within minutes, um, they started saying, no, get everybody and have them start evacuating. We don't know exactly what it is. Firefighters from all around the area rushed in to help. They battled the flames for hours, spraying foam on it in hopes of keeping it contained as anxious residents watched. The transformers uh, covered it in oil inside to keep it cool. So I just had to burn all the oil off. You can't be throwing water on it because the electricity is there. The trail of smoke seen from miles away, including by cars off Route 17. Nearly 2,000 utility customers in Bergen County lost power, but it was restored three hours later. And for some residents, this fire was just too close for comfort. When it's right next to your house, that's when you start freaking out a little bit. These are New Jersey transit train tracks right behind me. And at one point, firefighters were using this area to fight the fire just over the fence there. So there were several delays of up to 35 minutes on the trains. We're live tonight from Waldwick, New Jersey. Tracy Carrasco, TV 1055.